investing in something because you understand the value of it and not the hype of it like no oh yes you know both reactions so why this talk okay uh, okay so why this talk there were two reasons and the first reason is personal career look as as a as a person who is trying to be a mentor i don't want you to make the same mistakes i made because i didn't have a lot of idea i didn't have people to talk to when i was starting up so i made a mistake i i went into network and security the cyber security space hacker hacker thing uh, when uh, when i was young and uh, and that costed me a lot in my career uh, initial 3 years gone just like that i had to restart everything i was a very good programmer i went into non programming uh, in in the network security space and then when i came back the world had changed so so yeah like don't first thing is first my my own mistake don't make those mistakes and uh, second thing is i am been talking to you right talking to students or everyone around the world and the the bigger problem which i see is you know people keep asking is flutter the next thing is De will deno replace replace node should i just start learning swelt and uh, you know leave react altogether and and recently in a talk also i was in a, this is not recently now anymore uh, this was last year i went to open source india to give a a, 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 a workshop there and someone came to me and he said hey tane i follow you on uh, on on instagram and i i i, I listen to your podcast and and there is so much to learn and i always feel like i will never be able to learn everything and i totally relate to it it happens with me it happens with everyone so what you need is a framework a, a framework in your mind to to know what to learn and what not to learn this makes sense this is making some sense right cool so these are the two reasons uh and the third reason why i'm doing this i had a lot of a lot many uh, items but everyone in the telegram poll i think there was a unanimous polling i think 50% votes went to this talk and if you're not on telegram group you're losing out on so many things uh so just join uh so what is this talk okay so now let's let's get serious a little bit so this covers the sound principles of value investing if you don't know what value investing is it's basically uh investing in something because you understand the value of it and not the hype of it like no oh yes you know both reactions so understand the value and not the type uh, not the hype <laughs> and not the hype and that's value investing you know the paying the price so there's this book called uh, the intelligent investor which i have been reading i for i think almost two and two years to understand how finance works it's a really good book and that that book has this term value investing okay and i am a big fan of this this thinking so i'm just trying to share that thinking with you so so you understand what value investing is and then you use those principles to evaluate your tech investment so what is tech investment you know your time is money your effort is money and your career is money because when you grow experienced in some tech in few few years you get paid a lot more money than a fresher in that same tech like anybody who learns react today wouldn't be get paid to learn uh, to do react as much as i am doing it uh, get, getting paid right so understand that your career is money your effort which you are putting every day by doing something and not doing something else that is also money and your time is definitely money right every every hour you spent on something learning something it is money Uh, for students it's not right now maybe but it it will come as as a return on investment later so understand this part so invest your time and efforts wisely and how we'll just see but before we begin this is a beautiful shloka which my mom keeps telling me all the time um, so i just want to share it with you and this is very much related to all all the things so <clears throat> The shloka says that nacha chor haryam, nacha raj haryam, which means a thief cannot take it, a king cannot take it. Na bhatri bhajyam, na neither it can be distributed among brothers. Nacha bhar kari, which means you when when you carry it, you don't feel the weight of it as well. Vyayate krite vardhate evam nityam, which means every time you spend it, it increases, and that's why see all my, <laughs> I am getting goosebumps and. and that's why vidya dhanam sarv dhan pradhanam which means that knowledge is the best kind of treasure so when i'm 
you know when i'm talking about knowledge in in the sense of money don't for a second think that both are the same thing knowledge as money is much greater and also keep sharing your knowledge because that's not going to decrease your knowledge it's only going to increase the total num- total knowledge total amount of knowledge in this world so thank you mom for coming up with this like she didn't write it but she has told me so many times since my uh, childhood that this has like here it's, it's grilled here so don't confuse knowledge with actual money